Greetings, fellow portal masters. Greetings, fellow portal masters. I'm Crash Rousel, and it's once again time to crash the Skylands with the 151 episode of the Odyssey Half Hour. Thank you so much for coming by watching another episode of this series. Crazy. 151 episodes. Last week, we gave you the 150 episode. That was the last special episode episode of this entire series because from here on out we're just doing every single skyline or ever so it's series two three four minis and variants put them on the portal giving them a full-hearted honesty but it's a little bit different this time not really though it's actually honestly the same as it's been the entire time i've done this but this one's going to be a tiny bit different because during my intro i always say the same thing but i'm probably going to screw it up a couple times because if you don't know all the skylines that I haven't an episode yet are put away in this tub and so all the skylines in that tub are put into a random name picker. So what I do is click to spin whatever skyline comes up. That's the one I'm delegating half hour to. And I said it's a little bit different because if you guys know, for literally from the beginning of the series, all the way up to episode 50, I was taking all the skyliners that were in these tubs because there were three different tubs. But since there's only 22 skylines left in this entire series, there's only 21 in that box. One is on the shelf over there. I think I got that spot on. There's no reason to have three different tubs. So they're all now in one tub. That's how you know this series is getting close to the end. We still have enough for this year, I think, because there's 20-something episodes left. We're over half the year, and there's 52 weeks in a year, so I think we are going to be able to push it into next year, and I do take my time off during Christmas time. So, yeah, I think in 2023, this series will be over. Crazy. Maybe on the one year anniversary. It might be close. Not one year. Three year? Four year? Whatever year it is. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very excited to bring you another episode of the Honesty Half Hour. This is the first time I've recorded since the special episode with Smash Hit. So I'm very excited to bring you a special one of this. Who is it going to be? There's so many people out there hoping for Bumble Blast, hoping for Frino, that one guy who's been home for Double Dare Trigger Happy for the last like 20 something episodes. It's in the title, but I don't know because we're going to spin the wheel and find out right now. Who's it going to be? Perhaps a 151. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'm not wearing my Macho Man shirt though, so that was out of context, I guess. Not for me. Intros are weird for me. I'm really bad at them. Let's spin the wheel. All right. So on the CF hour, we have 21 names left. So again, 22. But that's the wheel there. So many people waiting for certain ones. I forgot Chompy Mage is one that a lot of people are waiting for too. This is gonna be exciting. Let's spin the wheel. Who is it this week? I'm always I'm always nervous. I don't know why. Oh, oh it's so close though. But it's time to get rid of another supercharger with deep dive Gilgrunt. Almost rigged it. <laughs> Almost got the Skylander you wanted, but I don't think you're gonna be disappointed with Deep Dive Go Grunt. Now, of course, Gil Grunt is the only Skylander to have five different versions of him in five different games. Shout out, dude. Imaginators really let you down. He could have totally been like a bow slinger sensei where he was like shooting bows. I don't know. He's in the game at least. So he's technically in every single game. It's a different variation. So regardless, Deep Dog Girl Gun came out in Superchargers. Superchargers, my favorite game in the series. I don't know if you watched my hour-long video about it. I could have kept going, I swear. But we're going to put him on the portal. Give him a fair run here now, which after this one means there's only one Supercharger left and the franchise is done for on CF Hour. That's how you know it's real. So let's put them on the portal and get this started. I don't know, man. All right, ladies and gentlemen, 20 minutes around the clock, Gil Grunt, deep dive version. It's up for some honesty. Look at his little hat. I forgot when you upgrade me, you can see little hat. Look at his hat, it's so little. What did his hat doing? So you're probably saying to yourself, Crash, the intro. Um, what's what's that What's that Reef Ripper? How is it black? How'd you make a black Reef Ripper? Please. Anyways, looking good. Looking good. All right, let's look at his move set. Of course, his main move is he has his trident. So you press square attacks with the trident. Circle does a long range lightning attack. Very good. It's kind of very similar to his uh, water spray move, except you use a lightning strike. 
Triangle begins hovering with the jetpack. You can press square to dash forward, circle to send a tidal wave, triangle to land. Hold square when not use jetpack to rapidly attack the enemies. Oh, I'm yawning. Hold circle while using jetpack to create a large whirlpool. It does more damage. I decided to go with the bottom path because I wanted to use the um, trident moves a little bit more than the tidal waves. I think they're fine, but I want to go with this one. You hold square to do more better attacks. There's hovering. So when you go into hover mode, it shoots lightning. And of course, hold circle down when not using jetpack to summon a powerful lightning storm. So let's take a look at all these moves now. Because as you see, there's he's 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 a big combo guy. Like you have to hold certain hold buttons and stuff. So his main move, of course, is his lightning Poseidon strike. He goes ha 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 you know? D Vive Dual Grunt is fantastic. Hold square. When he stops, though, is the question. He ain't stopping. He ain't stopping. Yeah. Hold circle. To do lightning literally ever. You see that range, though? You see that freaking range, bro? I missed the coin, I know. I don't need the coins, so it's fine. He's a level 20. I was... Oh, I got 101 wish stones. All right, I gathered an extra wish stone. <laughs> you know what? So, I'm, I'm doing... I, the video's probably already out now. So, let's just... Get this out of the way so I can still keep 100. Okay, perfect. Yeah, the video's probably all out of the way when I did 100 wish stones. I'm actually recording that literally right after this video in real life. If that's not out yet, then spoiler, you're going to see that video soon. Circle, of course, shoots a lightning bolt ahead of time. You can see it does pretty good range with it. And, of course, triangle is the hover mode. He goes into lightning. You press square. He does a dash. Like, look at that move. Whoa! That's fast, baby. And then circle, he does a big tidal wave shooting forward. And he drops down. That's a good move. So Battle Brawl Island? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we always do Battle Brawl Island, but we gotta see. We go. Have we ever done Bandit Train? Last episode we did Bandit Train. Shout out to me for legit just saying, have we ever done Bandit Train? Followed up by me immediately remembering that we did Bandit Train. Land of the Undead. See, there's a problem. There's a lot of driving sections, and I have I don't have his, his driving vehicle with me. Spellpunk Library? Let's do Spellpunk Library. That's one we don't really ever do. And then when we get to the driving part, I just, just don't do it. I just leave. You know? Wow. This place is incredible. Yeah, it is. Incroyable. Nerd. I'm trying to skip. Nice. All right, here we go. Skylanders of the dark element are stronger in this zone. He's a uh, water though. I wish there was a battle arena here that wasn't just battle brawl and then you have to hope Cali gives you that mission. No, Tessa gives you that mission. Centuries later in the age of the portal masters. That's me. The Skylanders. Those us. Well, fellow portal masters, right? Okay. But the darkness was still out there. We laying in wait. Did you guys know that? The darkness was out there somewhere? Cringe. The darkness is cringe, dude. It's cringe. Cringe darkness. Cringe. Suddenly, tremors and aftershocks rumbled throughout the land. Some great evil was being conjured. Nice to see that. You see that shot? Look at that. Oh, whoa. The spell punks. The devious <laughs> spell punks had unearthed yeah. the very same cursed relic that had allowed the darkness into Skylands. So you just press circle. It's just a range attack. Like. Dark rift engine. Oh! That boy did. That boy and his little hatter did. Wait, look at this. Look at that tidal wave, though. Yeah. Look at that tidal wave. I do get a supercharged power-ups now when I, uh... Or supercharged ability now when I attack things because I do have the... I do have his vehicle. Whoa! Woohoo! We're going up! You remember the time in Skylands when 
they were jumping across the platforms in that level, you know? And for some reason, he can't jump half the time. I don't know what just happened. It... Wild Fu Wildstorm, is that you? Say you, Wildstorm? What are you, what are you doing? What's Wildstorm doing? What the dog doing? Yeah. Ooh, look at that. You see the damage that does? Check that out. Whoa, okay. I didn't realize that was that powered. Sheesh. He doesn't even stand a chance, bro. Come forward a little bit. Look at that. And that life spell pump's just like, bruh. I can't do anything about it. Look at that. Oh, I didn't want that watermelon anyways, okay? I didn't want it anyways. I didn't want it. This is insane. Look at that. Don't you dare. Oh, I got the cherry that time. Don't know how, but I got it. I'll take it. And that's good. Wow. Um, That move, though, I didn't realize that did... Uh, what's it called? Stun damage. So, like, when you hit them, they go... You know? I didn't know that was a thing. Look, it's Splat, Dive Clops, and High Volt. Remember when they all had their episodes of Ansi Half Hour? That was a very long time ago, if you think about it. Splats wasn't too, too long ago. But the other two? Man, I think Dive Clops was one of the first ones. Oh, was I supposed to come talk to you? Hello. We don't have any air vehicles. Air vehicles are a myth made up by the government to make you buy more air. It's true, I swear. I read it in the magazine once. There's a wish stone up there. Not grabbing it, though, because it might, it'll ruin my video. Whoa! <laughs> what if I should kill that, bro? Ding! Oh, I almost got there. Oh, 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 Chucky? Give me Chucky. We're done this level already, by the way. This is the last one. <laughs> you can breeze through the Spellpunk library. It's actually ridiculous. Nearly been lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Water, let's go. He's gonna rip true dead. And go. Burr, 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 burr. I want to do one of those on like uh, what's it called? Um, on the like the enemies. So maybe I'll go to Monstrous Isles after this and see if I see what I can do for the um, the big babies. You know, like the main people. I actually know the only one I can take on really is the Terror Shark. Oh no, I can do the water one. I just can't do the big guy because I need to drive there, unfortunately, to fight him. That's a bummer, man. Like, I would have loved to fight him the entire time. Come on over. Come on. Oh, oh, you can't get me? Can't get me? Can't get me? Even in the face of this great evil, the Skylanders continued the quest. Yeah. 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 Ooh, ooh, knocked him out the edge. Nice, that range attack has some good range. It's almost like it's a range attack. Write that down. That's your quote of the day from me. Oh, no grapes, though. Oh. Yeah, yeah I'm confused, too. Mmm, he says. Yes, boy, pinata. Look how fast you tear through that with the holding square move. That's insane, dude. Run, bun. Whoa. Oh, look at that. Uh -huh. But they would fall before the Skylander like limp bundles of experience and treasure. Limp bundles of experience and treasure. Ha, <laughs> burn. Imagine. That's what you're known for. Ha, <laughs> ha. Oh, why am I slow? Did, 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 he, did he dead? <laughs> That's what I was just about to say. Did he dead? Ooh. <laughs> I like that. I forgot when you go out of the way, there's like additional storyline pieces. The darkness grew desperate. Again and again it attacked with renewed fury. Let me just land here and just get a quick Look at that, man. Jump right on his head. 
bruh. Take him out. Oh, or not. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Woo, we did it. All right, we did it. Quit out. I'm going to go to Monster's Isles. I'm going to take on the terror, the, the pterodactyl thing. And I'm going to legit just use that move the whole time. I just want, I'm just curious to see how fast I can kill it with just that move. Because that's sick. That's a sick old move, law. To the death. Oh, yeah? First of all, don't tell him what to do. Secondly, don't tell him what to do. I can just kill him from up here, look. Watch this, ready? I'm actually hitting him from over there. I did it! <laughs> I was just standing on top of an umbrella the whole time. You can say that again, Those guys Man, that was, okay, that was cool. That terrain busting move, you climb up on something where they can't hit you, you can take them out insanely fast. Oh, look, Gil was like excited about that one. I don't know if you saw that real, real quickly at the bottom there. For me, I can only see kind of a piece of it, just because the Pokemon Game Boy is in the way there. Don't tell what to do. And then you can bring the Titan size peach down. <laughs> we'll fly up ahead and keep an eye out, Skylander. Let's go, Flynn. Don't tell what to do. Woohoo! Is it me? All right, Skylander. That epic size lobster Titan has the eye of the angel. Oh, yeah? There's a giant wish stone over there. You see that? Look at that wish stone. That's like an extra wish stone. Oh. Oh, just give me one second here. Just, uh, okay, there we go. All right. Yeah, you were worried. You're like, crash. You totally forgot that you, that first part you have to drive to get to the pterodactyl, right? And I'm like, no. Maybe you forgot because you're smelly and you don't have friends. Burn. <laughs> oh, yeah? Sucks for them. Have a good one. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo, woo -hoo, up. Okay, so Terra Shark, nothing but the hold square move where I got to go, blah, 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 you know? I'm generally curious how fast I can kill him with that move. Oh, I'm. Oh, never mind. Okay, accident then. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh. He's already half health. He's. He's like one. Two thirds gone already. I never even done anything, really. Oh, you hit me that time. Okay, now I'm generally curious. Now I'm curious. Crash's curious has returned, folks. After like a three year, four year hiatus, something like that, whenever I stop doing that series, it's back. All right? Because I want to see if I can beat him. Have, what's the fastest way to beat him? <laughs> oh, yeah? That's a bummer. Anyways, goodbye. We, we. We those little jumps, I love it. All right, so I'm gonna do nothing but circle moves now. So like the range attack and the holding down circle to do like this thing. Ooh, wow! You sound like Crash Bandicoot then. Okay, so it definitely doesn't do as much damage. Fast, fast that is. It does a lot of damage, but it does do it as fast. 
It does a big kind of big big splash damage, but not definitely not as much. Okay, so it's it's, it's it's doing okay so far. Why are you standing behind me, you little dummy? Look at this range attack can actually hit him while he's still going, but it does do some pretty. I got I, you can't take him out pretty quickly, still. But like we compared to that other one though, oh man! All right, third time's charm. <laughs> We're gonna do nothing but um. What is it called? The the jetpack moves. And then we're going to go to the other lady. And we're going to go out and just, just kill her real quick. I'm very impressed with all these moves. Like, Because, I mean, Deep Got Girl Grunt is one of my favorites. I've talked about him in the every Supercharger Ranked video. I really think... I don't know about you guys. But I think some trolls... Might be stealing some rare eggs. Shark. Yeah. I don't know about you guys. I don't know. They might. Okay, so now we're only using this. So I'm not sure if um, I can shoot over his... This thing. When, when I'm in the jetpack mode. No! That's weird. I still have to jump while in jetpack mode. That's a normal thing. Okay, don't seem to be killing him as fast with this one. Okay, interesting. Interesting to say the least. I can't really do the dash move on him. You just have to, like, kind of... Oh, okay, he's actually turning to fight me this time. Okay, definitely not as fast as the other two, but I mean, it's not, not horrible. Yeah, definitely not as fast. But I did have more fun. Did you guys have fun? What? Money! Woo experience! Totally need that. Uh, next part's a driving one, so we have to use our little life hack, you know. Exclusive shores. We got one minute left. Okay, let's we'll just we'll just stop it now. It's no point to keep that on. Yeah, yeah. What time is it? Twelve thirty. Wow, still really early in the day. All right, we're actually gonna do the reef. We're gonna use the reef ripper. We're gonna use the reef ripper. All right, let's just switch it up. Okay, we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna use the the black reef ripper, which you're still probably confused about. So let me explain, please. <gasps> How dare you call me that? You don't know me. You don't know the life I've lived. I have a black reef ripper, and you're over here saying that to me. Woohoo! This is actually a Toys for Bob exclusive one that they sent me personally. Bob himself sent it to me, actually. They're like, hello, I'm Bob, you know? I'm really good at uh, driving underwater, by the way. No, it's more like I need to learn to drive correctly because I forgot I'm not good at driving underwater anymore. Because <laughs> I know how to, like, if I'm doing races, that's different. When I'm racing, it's completely different because, you know, I'm really good at those. And that's not even a joke. Like, I'm actually really good at racing in, Sky in Skylanders and Superchargers. I mean, I don't care, but... Woohoo! I almost got her. Woohoo, let's go! Oh, yeah? Wee, excusey.
Oh, hit my tail. We almost there yet? My god, I feel like I've been doing this forever. Yes, good. Did she say terror from the deep when she went tar? There's some tar from the deep, you know? There's some tar, you know? Tar. What the salty is your problem? Is that a term? Is that a term? What the salty is your problem? All right, but I'm gonna literally just do that move with her. My favorite one, you know. Oh, I forgot. She actually uses loses a portion of health before you fight her when you uh, do that side mission. Look at that, man. This is actually disgusting. It's actually disgusting how fast you can rip through the health with that move. I love it, though. It's so good. And I think this might be it. Let's see. No, she got one more left in her. Or not. Wow. Wow. That's disturbingly disgusting. Yep, there's a wishstone over there. Not gonna grab it though. All right, let's go right to the main menu here now. Oh, that was map, sorry, I meant to go to Academy. There we go. Okay, so that's gonna do for Deep Dive Girl Grunt. That was a very fun run of him. I had a great time, I don't know about you guys, but that was a very good intrigue of how he goes. But we are going to cut to just my face now and discuss him, so let's get this started. This is gonna be a fun one to talk about. So, Gil Grunt has always been one of my favorites. I mean, we, the majority of you who've played Skylanders literally started with Gil Grunt because he was in the starter pack with Spyro, Trigger, and himself. And I know for a fact when I first played it, I remember when I got the first three, I said to myself, I'm going to be playing Spyro the whole time. But then I was playing as Trigger a lot, and Gilgrun kind of sat there. But then I learned, like, Gilgrun, he's actually not as bad as you think he would be, you know? And throughout the years, playing with Gilgrun, going through everything, even doing that solo run I did on the channel that failed miserably. <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, I still had a fun time playing with Gil. And then Deep Dive, Dive Gilgrunt comes out, where they take the formula you already knew about Gilgrunt and gave him something brand new with a little sprinkling of what he still is. Because as soon as I saw him with that trident, I went, I'm intrigued. So let's run through his moves. Of course, that main trident move is so much fun. The lunge attack where you go after him, and then, of course, the move. You've seen how fast I tear through the parashark. You've seen how fast I tear through the beachcomber. Like, that was disgusting. How fast I was tearing through things with that. That's such an overpower move. I feel like I could solo this game easy with just Gil Grunt and that move. I might even be able to do it on hard or, or, or more, you know? It's crazy. His uh, other move with the range attack with the lightning bolt was so good for range. And then if you hold it down, it literally did lightning everywhere. It took out everything around the Terra Shark everything it broke everything if you didn't notice that go back and watch it when i shocked everything everything around the terror shark got broken and, and the terror shark got hit too so like it was it was huge and then of course this last move where he pops up in the hover pack it is really good for getting him a little bit extra speed and of course the main move where you can do the smackdown move but i don't see me using those as much as the other ones but i still like it because it's a way to make your character faster to get from one part of the level to the other and that other move is pretty good when you're kind of there like when you're already in jet um, in hover mode or jetpack mode whatever you want to call it it's 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 good you'll get the hang of it eventually but it's not a move i don't see i'm going to be using a lot because most of the time i'm going to go you know but Gil Grunt deep dive version is fantastic, and he's getting a perfect five from me. I think this is one of those Skylanders that they took an already great Skyland who already had a five from me, if you go back and watch this episode, and made him even better. Like, they didn't ruin him. They didn't make him worse. Like, Stealth Out, for example, her character was so much fun to play as in the original, but then they gave her the super shot Stealth Elf, and it's... 
It's not the same, right? So it's like they took these really good characters and made them worse. So when you see Gil Grunt, you think they do that, but no, they nailed it. And of course, that black reef ripper. Perfect. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Let me know in the comments below your opinion of Deep Dive Gil Grunt out of five. And of course, who do you want for a future episode of this series? This is episode 151. There's only 21 episodes left. Crazy to think about. But thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all next week for another awesome episode of this series. Y'all mean the world to me. Don't ever forget it. But as always, I bid you farewell.